Hey everybody, uh, this is Montana Bushcraft, and uh, today, again, I'm just going to try to uh, make some char cloth, or not char cloth, but it's uh, charred cattail. Uh, we got quite a few cattails around, and um, I've been looking on YouTube and stuff, and reading even in a book of mine that... Um, you can use you, basically from what I, my understanding is, is you take the, the, the cattail and smolder just like you would char cloth so I'm going to go ahead and, and do that today and uh, so stick to or stay tuned and I hope you all enjoy I'm still going to put the cattail in there and I'll show you in due time I'm just going to show you the I'm gonna make a fire here. Try to, anyways. So, again, I'm just on this in left hand, striking it with the right. start uh, doing this thing. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do here is this is my burning kit. I'm showing you on a different video line. So what I'm going to do is take the cattail, take all the fluff in it. And uh, good idea is not to be down there from that stuff. Whew. I should know better, but I don't. So I don't really know how much to put in here. But let's put a little bit at a time. Oh, shoot. I forgot about the fire. Oh, that was 
since you already saw me do it the first time, I'm just gonna cheat. What I was saying <clears throat> is, uh, I don't know how much I need to put in here, but I think that'll do for right now. Let's wait until this whole thing catches on fire real quick. I'm gonna put that in there. So, um, while we wait, I'd like to. Uh, have a couple of recommendations. Uh, also, to say thank you. Uh, thank you to everybody that's subscribed to my channel. And uh, I really appreciate the support, especially from Deep South Experience. He's a, a great guy. Um, him and I have been chatting for, for a little while. And uh, he's a, a really good character. He's from the South, of course. <laughs> And uh, he's, uh, he's very supportive, and uh, I, I want to say thank you, Deep South, for, for being so supportive to my channel and everything. And so if anybody hasn't checked him out, I would recommend doing that. Um, he's just starting out with his videos. He could use a lot of support. He's a great guy. And... Uh, so I'll go ahead and put his, his link in the description. And uh, another person that I would recommend checking out their channel is uh, is Kev Outdoors. Um, he's an outdoors enthusiast. <laughs> he loves the outdoors, and uh, he's got a lot of great information for anybody that that. Uh, as an outdoors person, even if if you're not a bushcrafter, if you like just hiking or camping or anything like that, I would check out his channel. And I'll put his description in the or put his channel in the description also. And um, so I'd like to you know say thank you again for everybody that's been watching my videos. Um, if there's anything I can improve on, just let me know. I'm just here to learn. And uh, I'm learning quite a bit, actually. So. So we're almost ready for this thing. I just want to get a nice little bit of coals.
another good thing to say is always stay, don't be downwind from the fire. <laughs> Smoke kills. But it's kind of going off at the side, so I'm alright for right now. <laughs> this, where does this say that it moves? Alright, so we'll go ahead and put the tan on. Again, this just has that cattail. So go ahead and stick that on here. Any of you have never touched a cattail before, I'd like to let you know ahead of time that they are very, very messy. They have a lot of fluff. So we'll go ahead and let this smother and in the middle kind of looks like it's up, so let's see if I can unplug it. Oops. Uh, and now it's going to be fire on the side. Now we got a flame in the middle. So wait until that dies out. Another reason why, I don't know if you've seen my EDC kit or not, but um, the reason why I keep a quarter in my pocket is for when I need to plug up that hole, I just use a quarter. Just as well as anything else, plug that up. That's about ready, huh? We shall see. So again, I'll put the quarter right on top of it. Kind of press it down a little bit because it, it likes to leak or smoke. There's, there's smoke still on the sides. There we go. So we'll go ahead and let that cool down for a bit.
So yeah, again, uh, check out Deep South Experience. He's got a great channel and he's very supportive. He's a very good guy. And uh, Kev Outdoors. Uh, Kev Outdoors, I've been following for a while. He's just got tons and tons of information. <coughs> talks about um, tracking, talks about the wolf project that he's on, or that he's doing. He's talking about um, some gear, uh, even shows you how to, if you're stranded in your vehicle, uh, we're not stranded, but he talks about um, gear that you should keep in your vehicle, he talks about um, how to make a can into a candle holder. That one's really cool. So check out both of their channels. Again, thank you everybody for, for your support. Thank you for the subscriptions. I appreciate it. And, uh, so we'll go ahead and test this stuff out real quick here. Ready. It should be cool down by now.
pop you off here. Any can't tell, this is what they look like, sort of, except without the I'm being all fluffy. Some of them do, but here's what happens when you take a piece off. So, very, very messy, but very fun, especially when you like that. Unless you put out your fire. as good as the char cloth, but oh no, it went out. So, I'll put it back on the fire again for a little longer. Since we have quite short. So, uh, instead of boring you guys with a very long video, I'm just gonna get back to you guys once it's all ready. Alright everybody, I just got done doing this and I think that it might work this time, hopefully. see it too well. Oops, sorry guys. Yeah, you can see it right there. So it finally did start working. Um, it took a little while for me to to get it done right. But yeah, so it does work. I don't know if I'd use this as. It's not, well, I guess it does work just as good as char cloth. I mean, it's still smaller and burning, so. That's good. So it does work. Works pretty well. So I'm gonna go ahead and close this and. But, uh, so, now you all know that it works, and, uh, so, thank you everybody for watching, and I apologize, this is kind of a long video, it's just kind of, 
uh, videoing most of it so I can kind of learn from my own mistakes and then if you guys wanted to learn from my mistakes also you don't have to do the same thing. So uh, I think it took roughly about an hour to get it all done with and the only reason why it took that long for me is because I put it on the fire for a little while and then I take it out and then wait for however long to let it cool down and then I put it back on the fire and every time I took it off the fire I'd always try it and for a while what it'd do is it'd catch a spark on it but then it'd just kind of go out and then after I left it on there for for a little bit longer and stuff it started uh, slowly getting better and it starts smoldering a little bit more and lasting a little bit longer so as you can see it, it finally finally started working right and uh, so now you know that you can do this with cattails uh, what I did is I kind of stuffed it in there I might have put too much in there too I, I don't know but uh, but I just kind of put it to the point that it couldn't really close that much anymore. And then I mean, it closed, but it wouldn't stay shut all the way. And then I just let it burn itself. So um, that's, I guess, how you make chart or cattail, <laughs> charred cattail. And uh, there's a lot more that you can do with cattails from what I've been doing my research on. So once I can find a place I can get the cattails around here uh, legally I'll, I'll go ahead and do more videos about it but uh, <clears throat> if you have any questions or comments or concerns just send me a PM or a comment and I'll be more than happy to to get back to you so again thank you for watching and, and for everybody's support out there I highly appreciate it I hope you all have a nice day now. Take care.